Yeah. And then going into the next one was <laughs> Adamas. Yeah. Was, it, was, Adam, was Adamas next? Yeah, Adamas and Montiel. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Knockout, knockout win for Adamas. Yeah. I'd seen Montiel fight before. Just let me defend myself. Yeah, we, we, we fought I'd, Charlo. I'd seen him no before before he fought Charlo. Okay, and I'd seen him take some like I'm not gonna say it. Pretty good shots. Yeah, yeah. And come back and, and floor some guys. Yeah, and I'd seen that from him. So <laughs> I knew what was gonna happen, and I probably should have just I got excited, and I probably should. So I text Ant, and I was like, Montiel's gonna knock out the down. Three minutes before, possibly. Probably less than three <laughs> minutes before it happens. I mean, it's the same hey, Carson, round that he gets I'm knocked saying, out in. Are you sure? Or something like that. It was maybe more like a minute. Yeah. As soon as he sent the te- text, he started taking shots. I knew that. I knew. So I knew the firefight was going to come. Yeah. And, and when I happened. knew, and when the firefight came, I thought Matiel was going <laughs> to stand in there, take something and give something. And, and I just, I had seen it before. I was dead wrong. And he'll come out um, on top. Yeah. yeah. And Adamus just, he turned it up. A firefight yeah. is almost guaranteed when Adamus is in the ring. Yeah. At some point, there's going to be some bombs thrown. I, I like him. I'm not gonna lie to you. So I, if if I remember correctly, so his only he has a loss, which I think people Ooh, have kind of uh, forgot. He lost to Teixeira, and I think it was because he gassed out. I think that's how I remember that. Just not which, good condition. Which kind of it, it doesn't bother me, but it's like if he just didn't gas out against Teixeira. If he just didn't gas out, but then like take a look at the firefight that happens in the third ish round. round. Yeah. How if 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 Montiel doesn't take those shots at that moment? Gets if he, if they both get through that moment, how strong is he going to be throughout the fight? Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. so he is a kind of a a little bit of a front runner. It's very exciting, but he's right there. He and was I, able to capitalize and finish in his fight because the last I think it was the last fight we saw from Adamas before yesterday was against Drevianchenko, mm-hmm. which was kind of similar. It started out like really heavy shots, and we were all like, "Exactly, okay," yeah, yeah, yeah. and then it exactly. kind of tailed off a little bit. But exactly. he's a problem, Adamas. Absolutely, yeah. We like seeing him in there with somebody. Anybody you were thinking specifically? Top guy. I mean, you you throwing him straight to Charlo? Top guy. You going straight to Charlo. Why not? Why not? I mean, he beat the guy that gave Charlo, what, 12 tough ones? Yeah. 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 Uh, Montiel is just such an awkward fighter. Yeah. So I'm not sure how much I hold it against Charlo that he didn't get him out of there. Because I I saw some of that yesterday. Like, Charlo didn't stop him. Look what Adamas did. It's like, well, they're different fighters. Right. Montiel was a different fighter that day than he was yesterday. Not to knock Adamas, but… It's not apples to apples. And I think we just keep trying to find... Shout out to the Charlos. We always trying to find a point yeah. for those guys. And we'll get to the other one because <laughs> hey. it is. We're always like, what are, I think he Char- could test them. Yeah. And then it's like, eh. yeah. And, man- then he, and then he smokes them. We're like, yeah, it's like, all right, Charlos. What about this guy? Yeah, shout out to the Charlos, man. <laughs> yeah. they, be getting a, they hope his back feels better. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I, will, I don't know who I would like if there's a name that comes to mind for Adamas. I would just like to see him uh, continue on. Big big year for Dominican boxing, though. He, another guy holding it down for the, for the DR. Um, All that coming, man. Where you know, I said this some weeks ago. There's some Dominican fighters out there that are going to make some noise, and, and I think Henry is Henry's brother. Renee, can you confirm that? Is he making his pro debut? Yuri at one sixty eight. Brother, yeah, I think he's making a pro debut soon. Shout out to La Bazooka Here in Vegas, but Here in town. The, uh, same, but the uh, Renee's a bomb. Yeah, but no, La- ladies, Renee's a bomb. Definitely, <laughs> definitely exciting for for the Dominican boxing fans getting to appreciate that. 